Hello everybody, Sly from DC here. I'm playing Culture for NetHack with my Maria Heine. Hey everybody! We're gonna spin a random character off, but we are gonna call it, in honor of uh, last night's episode, Lone <laughs> right. Wolf. My favorite character from my childhood, the Gary Gygax character. I think it was Gary Gygax who wrote that series. Shall I pick the character's race, role, gender, and alignment for you? Yep. What did I get? I don't know. Plunderer. Hey, you're a barbarian! Oh, no. Really? That is hilarious. You're a chaotic male orcish barbarian. <laughs> hey, Lone Wolf. Wow. wow. You could have planned that one better if you tried. No, I couldn't. That's like synchronicity. Of course, I get two food rations, a fortune cookie, and a couple weapons and a little bit of ring mail. And that's my start. I was gonna see maybe you'll find my bones, but I haven't died, so. <laughs> I guess you so will. So that's probably not gonna happen. Everyone's and I got your bones already, it's so. definitely not gonna happen tonight. Yeah. I started with a dog. Hey, let's uh, name our pet. Come in here, pet. Hey, puppy. Do I right click the pet? No. Do I hit extended commands and then look for the name? Right here. Uh, I don't want to name an individual object, do I? Well, yeah, I actually do. A dog is an individual object. Show choices. Maybe I'll tell them that I don't want to name an individual object. What do you want to call? Type any key. Can't select a dog. Huh. Um, what is the net hack symbol for a dog? <sighs> well, you know what? Now, I know you can do this from the configuration menu. You know, have a default name for your pet. I don't know. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> if anybody knows how to do that, let me know. I'll name my dog something. Well, I've got a sink in this room. Oh, hey, it's one of my brothers. Peaceful Goblin. So I hear they're going to have new skins for most of the creatures, so all the stuff doesn't look the same anymore. I'm pretty excited about I that. I think once this is full released, or shortly thereafter, uh, goblins and deep ones and all that will all look the same. Or the thief. What are they called? Rogue? No. no the, the, uh, they look like that goblin just did. Um, let's see what all looks like that. A goblin thief, I guess, probably is what I'm thinking. But, it, yeah, there's a lot of things that look like that in a later game, but... They won't do that anymore. And lambs and screechers won't look the same. That's going to be fun. Can't wait to see the new uh, the new graphics. Now, I was thinking, if anybody hasn't played this before, they might not know that there's a lot of things you can do with a sink. Uh, let's go ahead and have a look at the sink. There's a sink here. There is a sink here, it says. Um, first, let's question mark it. No, not question mark. What is this dungeon feature? Iron bars, or a tree, or a corridor, or a lit corridor, or a sink. Oh, okay, oh. thanks. It doesn't offer to give me Question more information, on. though. So I guess we're not going to get any cool quotes. You could drop a ring down the sink to see if it's a ring of slow digestion, I believe. That's one thing you can Don't do. Don't you lose it, though? Um, yeah, I think you do lose it. Another thing you can do is kick the sink. So, I'm going to kick it. And it says, clunk, the pipes vibrate noisily. Let's do it uh, another time or two. Hey, you got a ring. I did. I did not know that was a thing. You see a ring shining in... It's midst. Yeah, topaz ring. 
I'm gonna kick it a few more times. Hopefully nothing terrible happens. There you go, black pudding. So this is the uh, beginning of the pudding farming concept. If I was to have a dagger or something, we can come up here and maybe split the pudding about a million times, eat the corpses, get our HP and experience up. Yeah. So if I find a dagger, we'll come back to dungeon level one and try that out. Is it a, can you do that with a black pudding or just a brown pudding? Well, that's a good question. Um, I don't know. That might I be something you want to find out. I know. You try. Right? Consult the wiki once again, but uh, yeah, I know it's a thing. I just—it's not a thing I've ever actually done. I do plan on doing it just to see where it goes. Uh, my question, I'm wondering, is auto? No, auto pickup is definitely not on. I'm wondering why it was on for you in your last play, because I know it's been off for me every time. I don't know. I have infravision. Good job. I guess a barbarian starts with it. Ignore that. So, where are you going with your. Are you going to go in the mines with him? Uh, I mean, you yeah, should. Well, I mean, he yeah. can actually kill things. <laughs> right? It's not going to be like the wizard playthrough where you're just real vulnerable. Yeah, he's 1801. I'm wondering what that ring was. Oh, I'm wondering what that ring was that I picked up. Yeah. I'm not gonna put it on. It's topaz. I don't just put on any old ring that I get out of the sink, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I find that in real life, it's perfectly acceptable to do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're just hanging out, you find a sink. Yeah, if there's, oh, there's a, a ring, ring in here. In the sink, and I get it out after I wash it, I'll wear Oh, an amulet. Really, there is an amulet. Well, that could be death, though, on a stick. But it um, could be life. It could be life. It could be anything, actually. Oh, Reflection would be so awesome. Yeah, amulet of life saving and yeah. reflection. And well, amulet of life saving would be lost on you because you refuse to wear it. I want to see what this <laughs> cloak is. Well, now the cloak is enchanted. Because he wants 122 for it. Yeah. But just because it's enchanted doesn't mean it's good. It could be. Uh, we'll see how much the scroll is. Drop. What is that? Cancel. I couldn't drop it because I didn't get the uh, letter right. It's an I. Yeah. Drop by. There we go. Pop the clip. Um, scroll, whether it's Identify or not? Probably not, because it's 200 Dwarfments. So a scroll of Identify would be what? 26 26, Dwarfments. yeah. And Light would be maybe 50. Depends. It's kind of hard to say. Uh, that's the concept of price identifying, for those of you who are unfamiliar. What a thing costs can give you a hint as to what it is. Anyway, 200 could be anything. Oh, anything. but you're a barbarian. Right, so he's probably going to charge me a little bit more. Yeah. Because I'm a barbarian. <laughs> yeah. You're like, okay. Uh, let's see, your intelligence is, uh, oh, wow. My intelligence is seven. Yeah. So he's like, yeah, sure. That's the lowest intelligence I've ever seen. And identify scroll. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'll give you a good price on it. <laughs> Not 26, but 200, yeah. Um, yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, no. Uh, the amulet is 300. Do you have 300? I... Do not... Do I? I don't know. Yeah, 391. You should buy it. You think I should buy the amulet? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't try it on yet. Right. You think I should take it with me, have a look at it? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. It could be an amulet of strangulation. I mean... It could. That's why I wouldn't put it on. Alright, I'll buy it. There we go. Now, you know, there's another idea that we could probably play with for a second. I don't have enough food to really carry this out, but let's see if we can get our pet to steal from the store. I so, love pet theft. Yeah, so if I hang out here for a bit, my dog's going to go in there. Yep. Oh, you know, I think I can take it from right there. So the dog dropped it right in front of the door. The dog, I don't know how to name. Ah, and he picked it back up. All right, do that again. 
drop it right in front of the door. I'll throw him a fortune. You have to back up one. Does. Well, I, he's not going to drop it in front of the door unless I'm back one space, is Okay. Okay. Come on, Dougie. Uh-oh. Here comes a rat. Oh, Lord. Go in there and steal some stuff. <laughs> okay, rat's dead. You don't get to eat until you give me things. Next time you drop something in front of the door, I'm going to throw him a cookie to make him know that it's a good thing for him to do that. Oh, no, no, no. Some rats you can eat. Oh, I could eat that, yeah. Mmm. Barbarian likes rat. Okay, now I'm gonna throw in the fortune cookie. I don't know if this has an effect, but I think that it might train your pet to do this in the future. Okay, now display some. Oh, hey, he's already got a name. Idafix. Oh. Now I should be able to pick that up for free. Yep. So there you go. Anything that the pet drops right in front of the door, you get that for free. Um, yeah, and you should drop your amulet right there on the ground. Like, what? Oh, cool. Aha! Got the scroll. Give me that and witch's see hat. if the dog walks on it, because that'll tell you if it's cursed. Oh, that's a good point. Alright. Um, but what if no, he picks I, my amulet up yeah, and carries yeah, I, it off? I walk down Do it in the hallway? Yeah, yeah okay. Got off the shop. Oh, give me that gem. Oh, ho, ho, we're robbing this shopkeeper blind. Uh, bring me that uh, potion, my baby. <laughs> uh, here comes a rat. Ooh, dinner is on its way. Yep. Ooh. Everything suddenly goes dark. That so sucks. I'm blind. Okay, I ate it all anyway. Finish your dinner. <laughs> but mom, it tastes bad. I'm a <laughs> blind. I don't care. <laughs> it's a rat. You're not Eat even it. a half rat. There are on kids. The floor. There are kids that don't even have rat. <laughs> <laughs> you get a couple dungeons level down, you'll wish you had a rat. To eat. <laughs> That's for sure. All right, so we're gonna try uh, curse identifying the animal. I'd like to get the dog out. Yeah, here you go. Come, follow me. Come on. Follow me, I fix. Okay. Draw the amulet on the floor. And then we'll move up and see if he steps on it. Uh, uh yeah, I'm going to say cursed. it's probably cursed. Because he's trying to avoid stepping on that. Yeah. Alright. Well, that's fine. That's fine. We should have. Which means he wouldn't have stolen it to begin with either. Right. So they, uh, your pet will only steal non-cursed and blessed items. You won't step on a cursed one. So we had to buy that. You know, I'm starting to think it was a waste of money. Yeah, it's probably a strangulation. Oh, well. We'll sell it to some other idiot. Somebody who's got intelligence of six. That's who we're looking for. <laughs> <laughs> right. Where do they keep the dumb shopkeepers? <laughs> yeah, that's a, good, that's a good question. Oh, look at you. What? You got a banana and a tri brush, and your dog's gonna be so happy. Hey, hey! There you go. Uh, he got the tri brush. I feel like Ida Fix isn't a name, but maybe it's a stopping thing to say that is what they need to do is mm -hmm. ID Fix. Well, yeah, it might be a joke, but <laughs> nonetheless, I think it is his name. Isn't, um, we're gonna have to Google this, but I do think that Ida Fix might be a uh, mythological reference of some kind. Okay. I don't know. He just dropped a, yeah, a ring. He's he, got a no, ring. he picked it up and he's carrying it around. He won't let yeah, me have it. Yeah, put it on. Idafix, either put that ring on or drop it. One or the other. Maybe Did he I pick swallowed it, it. No, I picked it up. Yeah, okay, I'm tempted to say right. auto pick up his yeah. back on. Let's have a look. Yeah, auto pick up is back on. Sure enough, yeah, every time we change this, it turns itself back on. Evidently, though, like, you're not picking up corpses and stuff because there's a filter for auto pickup. It's in the config files somewhere, but who wants to mess with that? So, okay. Auto... Much more smarter people than us. Well, you know, I've done <laughs> it, but, uh... I don't want to do it again, let me just say that.
That's fine. You can just turn it off whenever we play. Come here, Idafix. Follow me. If we find another shopkeeper, he's all yours. What is that? Oh, Idafix got put to sleep by a uh, sleeping gas trap. Yep. Eh, not bothering. He deserves a break. Alter to Krom. My god, as Long Wolf, the chaotic barbarian, not Krom. Why isn't it Krom? Oh, well, because Krom is a neutral god. Yeah. So, Idafix is the French name of a dog named Dogmatics. Yeah, I don't understand. Some kind of a cartoon character reference? Oh, really? Okay. Curse identify the banana. <laughs> I don't care whether the banana is cursed or not. Yeah, cursed amulet, but I can try on this opera club. But we knew that because Idafix picked it up, so. Yeah. That's fine. You're weak, by the way. Yeah, I need some food. Placement. Nice, I like this placement. Stop it. Bring up my dang Windows menu. Alright. Yeah, so what'll happen is when I get into combat. You're gonna start with it. I, I'm gonna pray. I'm gonna find out who my god is. You know, it doesn't. Oh, set. Finish your prairie until it's set as well, please. Your stomach goes down. Hopefully, we'll find more food rations or at least monsters. Um, a grave is not what I was thinking. Not gonna eat a cobble either. Come on, Idafix. Next level. Oh, this is the Gnomish Mines. We decide we're gonna do the mines. I always do the mines. Uh oh. Hey, you filled our hole. Yep. Trap door dropped me down. Bag. Tiger eye ring. That's my second tiger eye ring. <laughs> tiger eye ring. Tiger eye ring. Yeah, I've got a cursed one and a non cursed tiger eye ring. And I'm on dungeon level 7, so I'm thinking that that trap door maybe dropped me a little bit deeper. There's no more corpse here. I'm gonna eat him and pick up the gray stone. So here's what you want to do before you pick up a gray stone: is look at the weight and uh, make sure that it doesn't weigh like. Uh, I think a lodestone weighs 500. Yes. And if you pick up a cursed gray stone or a cursed uh, lodestone weigh 500 and you won't be able to drop it. So the key is before you ever pick up a gray stone, make sure you look at how much it weighs. But if it is, if it weighs 10 and it's cursed, then it's a health stone. If it's cursed, it's a health stone. That one is, well, we don't know if it's cursed or not, do we? No. Hey. I mean, I don't. I don't see it in the inventory. Let me, I didn't pick it up yet. There we go. And it could be a luck stone. It could be a flint stone, it could be, we talked about this last time. Yeah. Could be any number of gray stones. Well, there's the way down. I don't actually want to find the up staircase before I go any farther though. <clears throat> Kill them all. Yeah, I mean, I'm chaotic, so this is just like, uh, that's not my dog. When you want to throw food, uh, when you hit well, I'm hitting T. I guess you could right-click yourself to throw something. I hit T. No, nope, you can't, can you? No, I think so. It might be an extended command, but it's easier to hit T. Let's try it. Let me just look, just for the sake of it. Just throw an extended command. Nope. No, I don't see it here either. 
Okay, so when you want to throw something, like if you want to tame a pet, then you're going to hit T for throw. Show choices will show you your weapons. Uh, show inventory is what you want. Uh, I'm going to throw in one of my food rations. That'll make him my follower. There we go. Let's pick up the shoes. Ooh, create monster wand. Create monster wand. Was that uh, altar you found yours? It was not chaotic. But you can convert it. But I could uh, possibly uh, convert it. Oh gosh, that's worth trying. We've got to try to do that. Let me get out of the mines and we'll go try to convert it. Okay, well. But I guess before we do that, we're going to have to wrap it up. Yep, I think so. All right, guys. Well, there you go. That's pet theft, according to Slash and VC in that area. How to use your pet to steal from shops. And check if things are cursed. And check if things are cursed. Coming up in the next episode, I'm going to go back to that altar and try to convert it to my own and use this wand of Create Monster to maybe get a sacrifice. Gift. That would be awesome. I would be so mad if you get a sacrifice. <laughs> Why would you be mad? Wouldn't you just be happy for me? No, oh. no I'll be mad for you. I'm mad for you, Sal. I'm mad for me. I'm mad for you. Alright, guys. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.